Howdy y'all, we're the Covies, but y'all can call us the Unchartered Texans. Hey hon. Yes? Do you know what Lampasas means? Isn't that Spanish for Lily? It is. In round Lampasas they find lilies in the streams. Really? Yeah. That's pretty cool. Maybe we should head to Lampasas. You want to go to Lampasas just for the lilies? Well, amongst other things, but they're going to have to watch to see where we go. Sounds good to me. All right, time for a road trip. Sweet! First, we have to stop at Texas Truck Wash, located off Hall Street, Corpus Christi, Texas. These guys do an amazing job cleaning off the salt and sand from your stay at the beach. With the vehicles washed, we're finally headed north. While in Lampasas, we stayed at the Little Lucy RV Resort, named after the Little Lucy Creek that runs through the RV park. This RV park quickly became one of our favorites because our side overlooked Little Lucy Creek and had a fence that was perfect for our dogs and our daughter. Even though we had neighbors, it still felt private and we enjoyed sitting outside in the evening listening to the crickets and the frogs. RV site is big enough for our 100 foot rig. And there is my gorgeous, adorable wife. We made it! <laughs> We also use this time to deep clean the inside of our trailer, truck, and jeep after our time on the beach. Shout out to Lisa with Grindbuster RV Wash and Wax. We'd highly recommend her if you're in the Lampasas area. Just go to the RV office and ask for her by name. Before. After. Okay, spray the, spray the gas. Spread the sand off the car seat some more. Before settling in for our first evening. Oh, watch out for it. Now the real reason we wanted to go to Land Passes, Texas is for our nephew's wedding. They were married at Hidden River Ranch in events. It was a beautiful Easy ceremony and the plan. ranch setting was charming. Congratulations to you both. We're Sunday so happy y'all found one another. I can't stop staring. You've put a spell on me. And I hope that you never decide to set me free. Dear 
dirty dream Is you forever moving next to me Let's not waste time or take this slow We've got miles behind us but miles to go So let's just break this down to the simplest truth While in Land Passes, we were able to catch up with family. Your colors changing like the times. And I'm taking. Darling, would you be mine? And I hope you know I will love you for the rest of my life. Let's not waste time or take this slow. We got miles behind us, but miles. Lampasas was the ideal spot to do a day trip through the hill country with family. From Lampasas to Marble Falls. To Fredericksburg. In Fredericksburg we got ice cream at Clear River Ice Cream Bakery in Delhi. And we found the perfect peach stand called Light Ale Store. Fredericksburg peaches are in season from mid-May to mid-August. Then we headed over to Lano for dinner where we stopped at Cooper's Barbecue. It's one of the best places for barbecue in all of Texas. And then back to Land Passes. Unfortunately, while buckling in our nephew and daughter, I forgot my wallet and phone on the hood of our Jeep. After driving out of town about 15 miles, I realized a mistake and went back to look for him. Sweetest couple ever had found my wallet and was trying to find something in it to be able to find me and return it. We want to thank y'all from the bottoms of our hearts. We also thought my phone was lost forever, but we found it 15 miles out of town where it rolled off the hood of the Jeep at the exact location I turned around to go find it. Then we realized we were out of gas and had to drive back to Lana. This is the Otterbox case. After sliding off the hood at 70 plus miles per hour onto the highway, the phone is perfectly fine. We stopped at the world's largest spur located in Lamb Passes, and just down the road is the oldest spring fed pools in Texas. In the 1880s, the springs became a popular health resort known for their healing properties. Then in 1882, the Park Hotel was built by advocates of the Santa Fe Railway. The 200 room hotel included several bathhouses and a boardwalk. These spring-fed pools are what Lamb Passes is known for. Side note, if you're thinking of moving to Lamb Passes, we found it to be a small town with friendly residents, a decent selection of stores, and it isn't that far away from larger cities. I want to thank y'all again for visiting us on our travels. Don't forget to click like and subscribe so you can catch us on our next adventure. Now come back now, you hear?